Hi everyone, it's Rosie and welcome back to my channel. Um, today I have another Dollar Tree haul and this one is mainly um, Halloween items. So I know um, some folks don't celebrate Halloween and don't decorate for it and that's okay. I, I understand that. So if this is not your cup of tea then it won't be um, a video for you to watch. But if you want to see what I picked up, hang around. You never know. <laughs> so anyway, without further ado, I'm going to show you a few of the things I picked up at the DT for Halloween decorations. Mostly my daughter picked these out um, <laughs> and she is older, you know, she's not a little kid, but she likes um, to decorate and stuff for Halloween, of course. So we picked up a few things and I told her, why not go to the DT? It's, you know, everything's a buck. <laughs> so anyway, let me start with my favorite item that I picked up. It is this beautiful welcome sign. Isn't this cute? I thought this was adorable. And it says welcome. And it has the little um, jack-o'-lantern in the middle there. He is a little separate. You know, he was glued on there. But I think it's so cute. And it has the black ribbon. Of course, you could take this the ribbon out, customize it the way you want. But I think this one is cool on it, uh, you know, on its own. Look, at, it even has like jagged, not jagged edges, but you know, it looks like jagged edges, you know. So, isn't that cool? I just like this sign and I was on a hunt for it. I'm glad I found it. The next item I picked up, let's see where we're going. Oh, this one. Look at this. Isn't this cool? Does anyone remember the Adams family where the hand would go across? Awesome. Now I'm dating myself. But anyway, <laughs> this is the little hands. And you can spray paint this another color if you want. And this, you can put a tea light in there. You could put a little uh, succulent kind of the little plastic ones they carry at the DT. So I thought this was cool for a Halloween decoration. So, and it did come, I think, in white also. I'm not positive, but I think it did. Isn't that cool? <laughs> and another item I picked up around that, that's ceramic like that one, is this. Isn't that adorable? It says, boo, an exclamation point, and it has the little gold top. Isn't that adorable? And you can put a tea light in there and put it in a window or something so it'll show up the little boo on there <laughs> so cute the next item i picked up and i've been trying to get this little light to go on actually i don't know the battery might not uh whoop, there it is i'm sorry i didn't see the little plastic thing was in there i might have gotten a dud because it's not working oh there it is I don't know if you get, oh no. It started to light up and then it died. But anyway, it's supposed to light up. And this is like a sugar skull in purple. There you go. And see the back of it? Thought that was cool for a decoration. See them? The little eyes. <laughs> yeah, cool. The next item I picked up is this Tales of Halloween. And this is a little book. Oh, it looks like a book, and it is a little container or box that can hold little items. And it looks like a book, like that. It has the owl on it. And then this is what the side looks like. So you can stack them up. They do have other cool ones that I'm on the lookout for. The um, skull with the roses one. I forget what it says. I think it says love potion or something. But they have a big one, and that's what I'm on the hunt for. I thought that was really cute, and it'll look nice. Because I want to do that, like, Victorian kind of old um, Halloween decor kind of thing. But I picked this one up just to, you know, just in case. <laughs> I also picked up this cute um, decoration, and it says, Eat, Drink, and Be Scary. And this is, excuse me, <laughs> um, it is cute for a tear tray if you want to set it on there or you can hang this up it has the teeth on the back or you could set it on a table just as is but i did like the antique looking um kind of finish on there and the colors 
thought that was neat. So I picked that up also. Then um, we got these bat socks. <laughs> these are knee highs and these are women's and it's size five to nine. They carry these every year during Halloween, but I thought this was cute with the ghosties. So we picked that up. The next item I picked up is this cute, um, this is a lantern actually. And once you put it together, it is kind of cardboard and, you know, paper and um, plastic. But this has a little haunted house and this side has the bats. That's what it looks like when it's finished. And I may show um, in another video when I uh, put this together. A tip that I want to give everyone is to use a regular glue or a glue gun to, to fasten it because the uh, strips in there, um, someone also said, are not that great and they won't um, adhere to it so it might come apart so just a little tip there but um, once it's finished I think it's gonna be really cool and that's the back and the tea light is included on it so see that's the back you can see the haunted house and the bats so that is really cool <laughs> um, another item that I picked up um, let's see what we have oh this is not halloween but it's kind of like a little a pen that writes in black and it has this kind of like little spy uh little i don't know what you call it it has little holes there that you can look and you could see things on the sides of you so i thought that was cool people have been hauling this and i just thought it was cute so and it says it's the confidential pie, uh, pie, <laughs> spy scope. And it's a novelty pen, like it says there. So, yeah, there's that. And another sign that I picked up actually was this join our black hat society. <laughs> and it's kind of a vintage looking, um, sign. And that's why I liked it. Um, and it has the orange on it and it they had this last year but it didn't have inquire inside on it so um i think I, this might actually be a duplicate for me but i thought this one was um i like the old-fashioned fonts on it and the looking look of it <laughs> so i picked that up and let's see what other goodies i got this guy here now, I think he's supposed to be a ghost that says boo. But my youngest daughter, um, she actually redid this. She used the back side of it. And she painted on by herself um, with a black permanent marker. And she did Oogie Boogie. So, she put that on, she drew it on the back. So, I wanted to get another one to see if she'll do that for me. And I can show you guys what the finished product looks like. So, um, that's why I got this one. And it is like a little, almost like a bean bag kind of thing. But it just says decor on it. But that's, the back is plain. So, you can paint your own or draw your own in. Because his face is kind of weird. I don't know if this is a mustache, a mouth. What is that? I don't know what's going on there. And it says boo on the bottom. You could save the boo and all that other stuff for something else. <laughs> and there's that. So, I don't think I have any, uh, too much more. Let's see. Oh. Let me see. Oh, we did get this. A uh, little skull guy here. We might paint him, might leave him like that. But it is a decor piece and it comes with the sand like that so he's cool and scary <laughs> so anyway um that is my little halloween decor uh haul for you guys and i hope you enjoyed this if you did please give me a thumbs up and hit the like button of course also hit the notification bell on your way out to let you be notified on when i upload a new video so anyway i hope uh, you have a wonderful blessed day and i will see you in my next one bye bye